This brief video is going to show you how to add images to your Google presentations, either as images or as background images. So most people locate images by going and doing a Google image search. So let's pretend that I want this amazing photo from Finding Nemo. I click on it. Now I could right click and save it and download it, but that would take a ton of time. I could also try and copy the image and paste it, but that might not work very well, depending on what browser I'm using. So the easiest thing to do is to select the option, right click and select copy image URL. Once I've done that, I can go back to my presentation and then I can go to insert image and it will usually default to upload Upload only works if you've saved and downloaded the image. We just copied the URL. So we want to do the buy URL option. And then we right click and paste the image URL. Once we've done that, the image should load. If it's the right image, you, you hit select. And then it will be inserted in my image. You can easily adjust the size of your image all right, by uh, dragging the corner. I caution you against dragging one of the sides. Watch what happens. Your image distorts and it gets all weird and it's hard to make it go back to the way it was. So I'm going to click the undo button twice and maybe I put that over the title part, get rid of my text and ta-da. Now, as I was looking at my images, I saw some really cool images that might work well for backgrounds that I might want to use on my other slides to make them pretty and colorful. So for example, this looks really nice. It's a nice picture of the ocean that I could put text in front of. So I like that image, so I click on it. Remember to right click, copy image URL, go back to your presentation. Okay. Now when you want to change a background, I recommend that you start with one of the blank slides. Um, it makes the text less difficult to clean up. But what you'll do is click on the slide where you want the background to be and click background and different options will appear. You can change the color or there is an option that says choose image. Again, you'll want to select the by URL image paste your URL, and if the correct image appears, click select. When you're done, you can either decide that you just want it for that slide, or if you want it for every slide, you would click apply to all and select done. Now, this particular image, see how grainy it looks? It's pretty distorted. If your image is too small, that will happen. You might have to fish around a little bit for an image that looks great as a background. If that one I'm not happy with, I can always go in and change it by clicking the background button, selecting image, and repeating the process. And that's how you do it, lovelies. See me if you have questions. Bye.